The success of the Lady Astronaut milking robot is based on the principle of free cow traffic. This means that the cow is free to eat, drink or rest, and to let herself be milked. The robot is designed so that there is no hindrance to cows entering it. Once being milked, they are fully in contact with the other cows. As soon as the cow enters the robot, she is recognized from the sensor on her collar. Milking is prepared on the basis of the cow's historical data. As a result, the robot knows the exact position of the teats and the ration to be fed. Up to five different types of feed can be fed in the Lady Astronaut, including a liquid feed. The rationing is determined by the milk production and the cow's lactation phase. This is also connected to external feeding systems, such as the Lady Cosmics Concentrate Station and the Lady Vector Automatic Feeding System. For optimum hygiene and stimulation, brushes are used for cleaning and disinfecting. By using brushes, the teats are cleaned more thoroughly than just rinsing. Equally, with the brushes, the underneath of the udder can be cleaned. The slowest quarter is connected first. Because the tubes are incorporated into the robot arm, the cow cannot step on them, reducing the risk of the milking process being disturbed. After each cleaning, the brushes are disinfected to prevent cross-contamination. The position of the cow is carefully monitored during the entire milking process without disturbing the cow. As a result, the teat cup is always straight under the teat, minimizing the chance of a liner slip. The speed with which the other releases the milk can differ per quarter. This is why the astronaut measures the milk flow separately per quarter from the robot arm right next to the other. The pulsations are adjusted per quarter based on the milk flow. During milking, the MQC monitors the milk continuously, safeguarding the quality of the milk. In order to be able to spot any health issues at an early stage, some parameters immediately trigger a warning. If the milk flow from a quarter drops below a certain threshold, the teat cup is removed by turning off the vacuum and pulling the cord. The teat cups can never fall on the ground. After taking off the teat cups, the teats are sprayed with an other care product. To do this as efficiently as possible, the other is scanned again because it changes shape after milking. When the milk is being pumped away to the milk tank, samples are taken to identify the somatic cell count with the optional MQCC. When the feeding box is swiveled away, the cow can comfortably leave the robot. Before the next cow is milked, the teat cups are thoroughly cleaned. The Lely Purar steam cleaning system is an optional extra. Lely Astronaut, the natural way to milk. <laughs>